Look at this, the Moonlight Realm. It's actually a pretty cool stage. A little nighttime style going on. Some, uh, all that bright sunlight. Really different. I mean, it's not like those nighttime levels, but this is just a little bit different. It says we need to do this, Gills. You get on top of me, or me, me on top of you, and so we can do this real quick? Absolutely, it says. Okay, let's do this. Let's roll around together. This is completely what best friends do. <laughs> I'm still wrong. See how far I can go with this. Oh, no. Oh, time to head back up. Look at the background. This stuff is floating around. I think there's a really big inconvenience here for the end of the level. I think you can actually fall down, like, fall down really far. Even Tails have the shield. He's like, oh, boss. Iron shield. And if you feel like you're falling, oh, I'll grab you. Oh, let's just fall down the hole. You know, but Sonic ain't scared. He ain't scared of nothing. There you go, Sonic. And an extra life. And back under the water. Hey, they start you off in the water on the first. Like right at the beginning of the game, they start you off. They're like, they're not even playing, they're just like, here's the water. Just bouncing off walls. Why couldn't you do that in Sonic 3 or Sonic and Knuckles back in the day? I mean, that would be awesome. Imagine all those hard parts. When Knuckles was the only one that could go through, and Sonic was like, I'm so confused right now, the hedgehog. Fast forward years later, I guess, coming to go. Oh, Tails, we might want to go up. Yeah, there's a pit of death. I believe this is it. Oh, awesome. Big thumbs up. Sonic and Tails made it through Act 3. 